So I just updated the you crap can cannot record properly. Peace. HP Critty Vision HD. Anyway, new software. It's 3.5 update, even though it came installed on a brand new computer that way, and the newest version of UCAM is 5. Must have been HP's way of saving a little dough, yo, on that bloatware installation. Okay, so, first things first, it has to uninstall the old version, even though it's just a version update. And so that means you have to reset all your settings. And I wanted to go through all of them while I had this running so I could talk through them, but most of them you can't access. You can't access the main control here for changing the lighting, but you can't change obviously which uh, Resolution, that's the word I'm looking for. Resolution, you can't change it from 640 by 480 up to the 12, whatever, by 800 while it's recording. And they've added the MP4 format instead of the AVI for the high definition. So maybe that'll make the small. With a smile? That would make the format smaller. I need to eat breakfast because I'm probably starving. My brain is running out of nutrients. Okay. So anyway, if you go into the settings that are available while you're recording in the advanced tab, and then they have video processing amp now with a color enable, which is not enableable, I guess because of the HD setting. Anyway, leave that default. Go to the camera control tab. There is a low light compensation already checked, and right now it is in use. And it does make a difference now, as opposed to it did before, where it was the same. But but watch what happens. So this is with the low light compensation on. It, to me, it looks blurry, like I'm a ghost specter, and it's like laggy. And so... I wanted to point that out and hopefully it looks that way in the recorded version not just right now but once I unclick low light compensation whoa I, I can move around and it's like HD without all the BS so something in their formula just takes way too much processing power or they're not allowing enough processing power for it I don't want to look like a ghost. Hey, whoa. It's like one of those pictures, the long exposure pictures where the light goes. Anyway, and if it's really bright, the low light composition just doesn't enable. It, it may make it less laggy and then also still be bright, but it does adjust since it's on auto exposure. So this is bright light. That's with the sunlight and then the low light competition take it off yeah it just becomes not laggy so imagine that and it's not I can't imagine it's the computer well ha <laughs> I hate this computer but it is an i7 uh, it's the second generation before they came out with the third generation i7 and it is a laptop but still with the quad core it's a quad core i7 processor it should be just fine it's got a 2 gig standalone video card so it should have no problem processing this I would think unless I don't know anything about how video cards and cameras work as far as processing images maybe it doesn't that probably doesn't come into effect I figure just the processor does and since it's an i7 it should have no problem and 8 gigs of RAM so psh, get over it you can piece of crap that's all I got. Just wanted to update about the update. It's a piece of crap. Still. Although the image is a little better. Just now it's laggy. <laughs> this will be good for my uh, dubstep video coming up to a theater near you. YouTube near you. To your bedroom or wherever you watch it near you.